All right, what's up everybody? I was 188 this morning. That is literally the heaviest I've been in over three years. I don't even know what to think about that. I feel fat. Um, <clears throat> also, with regards to the hypertrophy experiment, it's three months long, October's high protein, November's high fat, December is a mix, but I'm trying to inline our training days so that there's no really variance there. So rather than making it a month since the days are slightly different in each month and rather than making it uh, 30 days which I was originally going to do we're just gonna make it four weeks across the board so 28 days 28 days 28 days which means that to that this Sunday is the last day of high protein so I'm super excited about that because I'm tired of this high protein I had a protein shakes and egg whites and a rotisserie chicken the other day what the hell I'm on keto um, in other news I ordered some tights, some lifting tights, because Peter Pan's my biggest idol. Actually, that's not true. It's because I love lifting tights. They're the most practical piece of clothing out there. I never wore them before because I didn't have the legs for it. Now I kind of do. Uh, but the lifting tights that I currently have are falling apart at the seams. I was afraid that on squat day, they'd just bust open. So I got some from Mava, Mava, M-A-V-A, -A, don't know. Pretty good price on Amazon. I'm gonna try these on and see how they fit. Hopefully my 188 pound self will fit into them, so we'll see. On the way to the new gym, do some back. Got my tights on and they fit Crystal better than they fit me. Probably gonna order a large next time and give her these mediums, so yeah, buddy. You like your new tights, baby? Baby. You excited to wear my my tights? You wanna wear my clothes? No. <laughs> you want me to wear your clothes? No.
y'all. We just got done doing the Keto Savage Kitchen episode. We made pumpkin gummies, and that's probably going to be backwards when you read that, but pumpkin fat bomb, fat bomb keto gummies, kind of like a Halloween theme, pretty tasty, so uh, check out that video, um, pretty good stuff. Now, I'm about to edit these videos, get some work done in the coffee shop, maybe hit a Barnes & Noble, and just rock this day out, so I'll catch you later. Alright, what are we doing right now? We're going Juicy Tails. Juicy what Tails. What an awful name. To get some raw oysters. Here we go. And I'm gonna go finish this high protein month strong with some raw oysters because I love raw oysters and lots of protein. So here I go. Stuff. All right, so they, I was gonna get crawfish and oysters. The crawfish are out of season, and then I got, you know, six chicken wings that had a dry rub on it. But they came out, and they were breaded, so I couldn't eat my chicken wings. So all I got was six raw oysters, which is not very filling. So guess where I'm at now? To get more food, because I still have about a thousand calories left for the day. So I'm at Whole Foods. So let's find some more food. Let's go, it's cold. Alright, rotisserie chicken is toast. Um, protein macros have been met. I'm switching. Sunday's gonna be my last day high protein, so after that we're going back to the high fat. And I'm excited. It's weird, like when I used to eat high protein way back in the day, I had all these meal options that fit the macros. Now it's like I'm struggling to figure out what works, what doesn't. It's been so long since I've eaten predominantly protein. So uh, excited to go back to what I know works well with me. Let's, uh, let's go home and edit this video and I'll catch y'all later.